it's cool dude, climb out here. Just doing a little vlog on the last day of the year. The moon's already out. So, what can I talk about? Oh, a future of my YouTube videos as long as my channel doesn't get taken down. Because I'm still a little bit worried about that. There's going to be less of these I need help with this and I need help with that. How do I do this and how do I do that kind of videos. Because I'm sure you're all sick of those. Now I've finally got Windows 10 working the way I want it. <clears throat> Just make sure there are no people around. To hear me aimlessly rub it into the camera. Yeah. <clears throat> Stupid throat keeps getting gunked up with scunge. What else was I going to um, say about... Oh yeah, the Star Kids. Um, I've almost got episode 7 all written out. Um, I've got all Ruby's ideas in there and um, some of Deep Citrus's ideas that they sent me. So, the rest of all of that's going to be in episode 8. Still got to finish off episode 7 first. Not much happening out here. As you can see, around here in the winter time, this is like a freaking war zone. This is why I hate winter. Everything's so bare and lifeless, and God, it's so depressing. At least we're past the winter solstice now, so the nights should start getting shorter and the days should start getting longer again. And I won't have to wear a coat anymore. <clears throat> now, the electronics videos. I know I haven't done an electronics video for quite a while. I mean, sort of taking a hiatus off YouTube. Also, the noisy neighbor of ours, I haven't really been able to think straight, although, come up with something to shut him up. Hopefully it's worked. I mean, the other day, okay, we went round his house in time to stop it playing. Okay, and he did. And he promised never ever to play it loud again. But a week later from there, you know, it was back. Full blast. And another time, he was actually around our house and he heard how loud that we hear it. He said, you know, that's too loud, I will turn it down. But he didn't. So after he promised twice to not play it loud, it was still going just as loud as it ever was. There's a person over there, so I better sh sh be quiet so he doesn't think I'm some insane lunatic who's rabbiting on while walking along. It's so hard to do these things when people are everywhere. I wouldn't think there would be anybody else today. Yet everybody's everywhere. <clears throat> Yeah, but we came up with an idea that's hopefully worked. Hopefully now he realises and won't do it anymore. But we'll have to see. Or sometimes it wakes me up with his music. So I never get enough sleep that I need. It's no fun, I tell him. I used to feel so safe and secure ever since he came in. My life has turned to crud. It's ruined my life. And I've gotten so paranoid now. 
every time I hear low frequencies, I think it's him. I have so much anxiety, and I'm so paranoid about, you know, whether he's got his music on or not. Every time I hear a low frequency sound, I think it's him. So I turn all my stuff off. I anxiously listen. That wouldn't be so bad if you actually played something good. But it doesn't. Just. I mean, what's the tune in that? like I was saying. So I will turn to the electronics videos when I can. Hopefully that won't be too long for now. I mean, it's still got that tape recorder video to do. Still got a few other bits and bobs that I want to do, you know, electronics-wise. And of course, I had to shut off the camera because people everywhere used to be able to go down there and they've put a fence up. Uh, oh, my battery's coming. My battery's about to run out. I better stop. Oh, damn people everywhere. As soon as I turn the camera on, everybody comes out. So I turned the camera off for a little while. The cam battery was like on its last bar. I turned the camera on now and it's gone back up to three bars. Anyway, what I turned the camera on to tell you was another idea I've had for my future videos. Now, I have some really fascinating dreams, and I really want to share some of those. You know, I thought I'd do a video where I, you know, talk about the dream and show a few basic sketches of what I saw in those dreams. I mean, I can even remember things from back when I was like, maybe three or four years old. So, it's crazy some of the things you can remember. Hmm. Don't tell me they're actually gonna start building the rest of that wall. Is this that house where they only built half a wall and then stopped? Looks like they're actually gonna do something now. Oh well. I guess that's it for now. And this is what we set up in the kitchen to deal with our noisy neighbour. As you can see, speakers turn round right up against the wall. Give him a taste of his own medicine, so to speak. I think it worked. Play this with the speakers blurring out, making the whole house shake. This thing wasn't even working up a sweat. I think he got the message though, because since then he hasn't played his music loud since then. Even though, a few weeks beforehand, he was round here, and he heard it. He heard just how loud it is. And he promised to turn it down, but he didn't. He still played it loud. I mean, ideally I wanted to set up an EMP device. That would nuke his stereo, but I didn't really want to nuke any, any of our own stuff in the process. So this is what we did. I mean, we're not normally noisy people. Only ever did it that one time. But it got through to him. Look at that. One bird came out right to my window. Now don't come in here. Okay. You're so tame. Just putting my lid up. So he doesn't get in. It's never happened before. Just peering into the room. 
Oh well, it didn't. He's still at it. It might be just a hair quieter than it used to be. Still not acceptable though, I mean it's not like he's the only one in the house. I'm fed up with it. The other tenants in the house are fed up with it. You know, their house, I mean. It's just not acceptable at all. We're going to get in contact with his landlord. Hopefully have him evicted. What's all these problems?